In this tutorial, I will show you how to append or combine or merge two CSV files using Node.js. You can actually use this script to append a wide variety of files, including files um, of different types, such as text files and CSVs. However, I've only tried it with text files and CSVs. So if you can confirm others work, feel free to leave that in the comment section. First of all, of course, make sure Node.js is installed on your computer. Okay, let's get started with the script. First, we import the file system for Node.js. We'll say var equals require Next, we will create a function that will take two parameters, the original file and the file you want to append to it. Uh, let's call this function uh, read append. So function. The reason I name it this is because you're going to read a file and you're going to append the files. We're going to take two variables, file, and which is you're going to be your it's going to be your original file and then append file maybe i need to work on renaming my variables but append file so that uh which is going to be the file that you append to the original file called file so uh next we will actually the, fir the first function we will actually have to call inside this function uh will be the read in function um, you can see the documentation for the read file at the Node.js site, at the link, um, at this link over here, nodejs.org. Um, here we can see the documentation for how to call uh, fs.write file. Oh, excuse me, uh, read file rather, fs.read file. So we can just copy their example data here and bring it over. get some spacing on this. I'm not going to bother with syntax. Um, we then want to replace the file name that they include, which is a specific file, um, with our own variable, which will represent each individual file. The reason I want to do this is so that if we, in the case that you want to merge multiple files, you can, uh, you can do so in the same script. So let's just call this, um, I think I call it file. Um, in addition, so we'll, we'll keep this the rest of this. In addition, let's just change the console log here so that if it if it succeeds, it's going to give you something useful. So let's say file was read. There we go. So the next thing we want to do is uh, call the function for append the file. Actually, and, and I found this is actually append file. Uh, the next thing we want to do is call um, call the actual append function. Uh, this we can also find at the Node.js documentation site, and uh, it's down here. And we can see that it takes a file name and the and data, and then this will give you an error callback. So uh, we can just copy their information here, and again paste it. And it doesn't paste very nicely, but um, so with this information, we can um, we we again want to replace message.txt with a variable. That's their file name with a variable that we're gonna we're gonna give it. Uh, in this case, we're gonna name this variable file. Uh, I had confused these two. So again, append file will be your variable inside the read file function, and then just file will be your variable inside the append file function. Uh, then we want to replace a second variable with data. Uh, and this is fine for an, uh, a log output as it's actually kind of useful. Um, now that the script is written, we can start adding uh, some files to this. So uh, this, so far the, the function will read a file and then append it. Uh, append them together. So what we want to do is name our variables. So first we want to say file um, and here you want to name your original file. Um, in my case it is um, it's going to just be called head file 
this will be the file that holds all of your data. Uh, sorry, hold, this is the original file that you want to append files to. Uh, in this case, called file.csv. Um, we then want to add the file that we want to append to that. So we will, uh, in this case, it's up here. It's append file. So let's let's name it append file, uh, and it's going to be it's this is going to be called test one. And of course, these files, you, you can replace the file names with your actual files. These are, these are already created. Um, so you just make sure you have the right uh, folder directory. And oh, I realized I missed the slash there. And my um, finally, we actually want to call the function. So the function up here, read append. And again, remember, it takes in file and append file. So just give it file, comma, append file. Uh, if you run the function like this inside terminal, um, if you run our file, append file.js, you will be able to append these two files together. So head file, which uh, I will show you. Um, head file is simply going to say uh, this is the head file. And then test.csv is going to say this is test1. So what's going to happen is when we run this function, head file.csv will now contain the text from those, those two files. Um, however, um, I want to call a sec the, file a sec the function a second time with a different file. That way, um, I can show you how to merge multiple files at once. And you can, you can repeat this over and over. So in this case, we want to get, name a new append file. Um, and that will be uh, test2 slash test 2csv and um, this is the, this file we're going to append to this one which will also append to this one um, or rather this original file will have this appended to it and afterwards we'll have test2 appended to it um, so we, we want to call that function a second time. And again, we say file and append file. Now, when we call this, we'll have all three files merged together. So, and just let me just read through quickly. Yes, this is all correct. Um, yeah, so that, that all looks good. So now, uh, we're going to see if it works. We're going to go to terminal. And we're going to call node um, and then call our file name, which will be append file.js. And so let's see. Call it. Oh, it seems like there's an error. Um, sorry about that. Test file. Ah, I see. I am calling a different one. So I had this one saved. Call it again. Ah, there we go. This was a previous version of my file. So it actually looked, it was fine. Um, and so it says, yes, file was read, file was read. And finally, um, the, the, it was appended once, it was appended a second time. So let's actually see what our file looks like. I go over here and I open up head file.csv and we see the original one, this is the head file, and then we appended, this is test one, and we appended to that, this is the second test file. So, uh, if you ever wanted to append, you know, 100 files together, um, you simply keep copying over this function, um, and then just change the, the append file with your file name. And that is how you append multiple files in using Node.js. Thank you very much for watching.